What is going on? It's been a minute, right? All right. So since then, I've gotten a sewing machine. And of course, I need a pin cushion. Thought about buying one, but I didn't really see what I liked. And then plus, I was kind of cheap, so I didn't want to buy it. So I decided to make one. Uh, a friend of mine gave me this uh, Gucci bag a while ago, and I kind of cut it up and put it in some jeans. So I decided to use the leftover material to make a pin cushion. First off, I took a piece of that box that you saw over there. Uh, I used the top of the jar lid to make the circle. And then using these cheap dollar store <laughs> X-Acto knife, which the blades are cool, but it's the it's the holder, like the, the stem, what do you want to call it? The handle, it sucks. So yeah, I cut that out a little too big, so I shaved it down a little bit. Put it back on there to make sure it fits. Launched stuff to the side. Then I found me a piece that I could work with. And let me tell you this part right here, I did not know this is metal like a metal coil in there but yeah i couldn't even cut that it's when it went around it so yeah ended up cutting that out of there boom 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 <laughs> make sure i got enough honestly i probably could have got a little man it went a little bit bigger but hey we made it work what it was after i cut that out then i kind of put it on top of there to see if it fits then i took this uh glove that i had i went thrifting and i got a jacket and inside the jacket was one long glove so boom i threw it away and i was like well you know i can use it and here i am using it i can't throw things away I'm a bit of a pack rat reporter but anyways though chopped up the fingers i figured that'd be enough that'll be my inside of my um pin cushion so i started gluing I mean, hot gluing around the edges and then kind of just folding it over just tucking the fabric right there uh it's not gonna look the prettiest on the inside but on the outside it's gonna look pretty cool um it's okay it's for me so if i was to make these junts and sell them i would like definitely doctor it up to look better but you know it's just for me so like i said it doesn't really matter so yep just tucking and tucking and tucking and tucking and tucking away <laughs> burnt my hand a couple times after that i stuffed it with all of the glove finger bits and pieces got it out all in there stuffed in there pretty good kind of already see it coming together then trying to close this bad boy off i didn't really have that much fabric to do that but i made it work took the top see if it fits in there now this part had the metal like it got so hot oh my god it got so hot burn like a couple times i tried to make it like it didn't burn me but it definitely did Got that bad boy in there. Put some glue around the edge for a little bit of support and stability. Let that dry. Cleaned up a little bit. Cause you know, I gotta keep a happy workplace. Oh, and look at my new grid. I made this out of dollar store uh, cutting boards. Neat, right? So, it's kinda dry. I'm gonna put all my stuff in here. Sewing stuff. And boom that's it that's pretty cool right practical and looks nice looks all high-end probably should have painted the lid gold that'd look cool oh well too late now <laughs> 